I am still shocked that Draza decided to go over to FaZe instead of Optic. I get it from a roster perspective. Like, if I'm Draza and my hardest matches that I've played for the last two years have been against Selium, Simp, and Ibiza, if I'm solely thinking about winning exclusively and only care about that, I know some of you guys would argue that's like the most important thing and the only thing players should care about, but I disagree with that statement in itself. But I, if I were Draza's like manager making the decision for him, I would have said, yo, I don't give a fuck what you think. You're going to go play for Optic. If I'm a player under any circumstance, do I ever in any capacity decline opportunity given to me by Hector and the the Optic Call of Duty team? I mean, obviously it worked out for Optic. This guy, Kenny, is just... The man just rises to the occasion, bro. What was it? What was that map chat that had like the trains on the far right and on the far left? It was a street with a couple cars and the middle was like a broken building in Berlin. Bro, I will never forget against FaZe in that COD Champs final, or maybe it was winner's finals or the round right before COD Champ finals in Vanguard on Berlin. This guy, Kenny, like, legitimately, I've never seen anything like it. The guy just hit his second gear. Like, I, I don't know about you, but after watching Kenny for years and years and years, having him part of LA Thieves, and I mean this with all due respect, bro, there were certainly maps and events where I'm like, yo, this guy is supposed to be our fucking all-star, superstar player, and he's having a couple stinker maps, you know? And I'm not saying it's because... He wasn't performing well. Like, sometimes that's just the way it goes. Your timings are completely off. Like, it seems like every time you die, you're just not in a, a, a favorable situation to get a kill, and you need to pull off something fucking miraculous just to get out of the cycle that you're in. It happens, bro. You guys might not think that happens to pro players, but sometimes there are just, like, you are stuck in a two, three-minute fucking cycle where it is. it just feels impossible to get a kill.